The Afghan government on Monday claimed to have repulsed a major Taliban onslaught on southern Helmand province, killing over 70 terrorists in the ongoing clashes. According to the country's interior ministry, additional troops arrived in Lakshar Gah city, and the air forces were, were continuously targeting the Taliban on the outskirts of the provincial capital. Molawi Gafur, the Taliban's shadow deputy governor for Helmand, was released from a government prison recently and detained last night while leading a fight in the Inahra Siraj district, the governor's office said. The governor's spokesman, Omar Zouak, told Evandola Agency Monday the security forces had withdrawn tactically from on their checkpoints in the Baji area on the outskirts of Hel Helmand. The Taliban's lead spokesman Zabihullah Mujahid and the group's propaganda site Al Amara are silent over the developments. But dozens of pro Taliban social media accounts have posted claims about advancement on Lakshirgah with the insurgents entering parts of Lakshirgah. According to US Taliban peace deal inked in February, the insurgents are not supposed to attack major cities and provincial capitals. Ahmed told in tri Afghan talks in Doha, the fighting in Helmand flared up days after the top U.S. military commander in Afghanistan and the U.S. Special Representative for Afghanistan Reconciliation discussed reduction in violence with military and civilian leadership of Pakistan. Khalil Zad and Chief of Army Staff of Pakistan General Kamar Javad Bajwa agreed that intra-Afghan direct negotiations are a historic opportunity for achieving peace in Afghanistan and for the region. According to the statement, Khalil Zad, Miller and Bajwa affirmed the need for a significant reduction in violence in Afghanistan as peace negotiations between the two sides move forward, added the statement.